You are the fakest faker ever. Is this just a show of fakeness? <laughs> TG, what is that? Are you sick? I'm sick. Don't quiet, Daddy. Shh, be quiet. Daddy's sleeping. Help me! <laughs> no! Now she's no! gonna act like she's falling off a cliff. No! 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 <laughs> no! no! She gets mad if I don't no! let her fall. No! She wants to fall. No! Yeah. No! 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 <laughs> And then she gets upset when she hits the floor. Oh no, you fell! Come on. Oh, you are careful. Yeah, you gotta be careful. Say careful with Gigi. Oh, you okay? <laughs> you okay? You're okay. <laughs> You're such an actress, Graceland. Oh, help me! Get up here! Say help me up! Help me up! Oh, Gigi! Oh! <laughs> You guys need to go to like, you guys need to go like try out for a movie or something. <laughs> Dad and daughter like trying to survive. I can save you. <laughs> no. <laughs> the dramatic ending. Magic. <laughs> Graceland, it's daddy. For some reason, she keeps calling him like she'll go Patrick and then she'll go daddy. So go, Patrick. She's just go always coming on my real name. You gotta get buckled in. It's buckled in? Yeah. This is a, a basketball. Basketball? Where are we going? Do you remember? That cough is just giving me really bad vibes. You have a cough. Yeah, you can't get sick before we go on vacation. She's Either. getting sick right now. Suck this um, Suck. 100%. Yeah, but... We're gonna have fun, yeah. We're going to jump. Um, jump in there again. A bed. We're, no, we're not jumping on the bed. We're gonna jump on trampolines. Wait. Whoa. I need to keep switching. Did you forget something? Everything. Please. Everything? How do you forget everything? Oh, gosh. Okay, good morning, guys. Today is... Tuesday, March 12th, 2019. We are trying to make it out the door to go to this trampoline park to let Miss Little Gigi jump and we're gonna jump with her too. We're running a little bit late right now. They have toddler time from 10 to one and it's currently 11.36 and I'm hungry. I need to get something to eat or I will literally fall over and die if I don't eat something really quick before we go. I think they might have food there, so maybe I'll just like risk it and get something there, but I 100% yeah, yeah. need to eat. And then we get in the car and Patrick just literally forgot like everything that he needed. All right, you ready, girl? Jump in. She's heartbroken. <laughs> so we decided before we go to jump, we just we just like ditched the whole idea of toddler time because we're not going to make it, so we're, we're just going to go at the regular hours, but we're going to go into Applebee's because, well, we're starving and we need to eat before we go jump around and burn off a lot of our energy on a trampoline. This little girl is heartbroken because the whole way we were telling her. She thought we just weren't going at all. Yeah, we're gonna go baby, okay? We just have to eat some bites first, okay? Patrick, this is like where we would go back in the day. <laughs> when we were teens, we would always like come here and eat. Yeah, look at this girl's hair. Her hair is finally starting. It's not like growing in length, but it's getting thicker. Oh, look at those eyelashes. But it's just really hard to like tame this because it just, it's starting to curl. Like, it's honestly gonna look just like Patrick's hair. Like, turn your head that way. His hair is like kind of curly, as you can see. Kinda. Yeah, he has the thickest hair ever. Like, you can't really tell. Your hair actually feels thin right now. Yeah, it's a little thin right now. But. It's just because it's like flat. You're gonna have daddy's hair. What color crayons do you have? Red. Red. And then what other color? What's this one? 
Green. Good girl. All right, we are at Altitude Trampoline Ow. Park, and we missed toddler time, like I said, because we just took like an hour to eat, but it's okay. We're gonna just go during the regular time. I don't think there's many people here, so it should be fine. We gonna jump? Yeah. Yay! <laughs> All right, not too much, Daddy, we just ate. <laughs> I feel like our stomachs still need to settle. Okay, there's literally nobody here. Wait, Patrick, where do you go? No, she knows that she has to get socks on. Yeah. She was always saying socks on. You're so cute with your little hair that keeps like sticking out. Jumping. We're gonna jump. Jump on a bed. Jump on the bed? It's a trampoline. Trampoline. Pween. <laughs> you know how when we try to like teach her new words, we like split the word up? Yeah. Trampoline. Yeah, trampoline. Trampoline. All right, we have to fill out a waiver in case you know we break our legs. Gigi is so excited that she's literally taking her shoes off in the middle of us signing our little waivers. She already has a waiver because uh, she's been here before, like with my mom and my sister and stuff. Okay, guys, we're in here and we're still the only people in here, which is like. Perfect! Look at this little girl! Jumpy! <laughs> Look at her! Jump, girl! <laughs> is that so fun? Oh my god, they have a rock wall. What is daddy doing? Oh my god, are you gonna jump? Oh my gosh! Was that scary? Yeah. Look at her, she just went straight into it. She's coming to get you. Okay, so they have a rock wall, a ball pit. There's like, I don't even know what those are supposed to be. There's another ball pit over here. And then there's, I think there's basketball hoops back there. is just like dancing to the music. She really likes the music that they're playing. Good job, yeah. She climbed up that all by herself.
Okay, we've been jumping. I think our time is almost up here, but I am so tired. Like, this is actually really freaking exhausting to jump around like this, but Gigi Girl's having a lot of fun. But me and Patrick are both like, we are dead. We're fat. Yeah, <laughs> we're fat, and now Gigi's just making a little stack of blocks with these. That's actually kind of a, she's so like creative for that. Yeah, she started doing it on her own. Yeah, she just like started grabbing them out of here and started making her own little block tower. There you go, you gotta stand up. See how tall you can get it. How high can it go? Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> now jump in there, G. Jump in, jump. Jump in. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> can you jump in? Go in. Go in there. <laughs> She's kind of like afraid to jump on this. No. Here, bud, catch it. Catch it, catch it, catch it. Good job. You wanna? Did you do that? She did. Oh. <laughs> We're all done. All done. That was a workout, wasn't it? Is that fun? Got your water bottle because you're so thirsty. You had, fun? you had fun. Look at her cute little socks. You have to wear like these socks here. Look at her tiny little feet. Yeah. Now we're all done. Oh. All done. Okay. Yeah, so we gotta take your socks off. Oh my gosh. Fresh air. Literally feels Careful. so nice right now. It wasn't like hot in there, but you just get you get so hot. <laughs> so sunny out today also the sun feels really good um but yeah we're done it was lots of fun we had a great workout i'm pretty sure i pulled like uh several different muscles because i was trying to do like jumps like from when i was in cheerleading i tried to do a front flip and it just like yeah no didn't work but overall we had fun Gigi loved it and we will definitely come back because it's something to do and it's also some exercise that we can get. Okay guys, it is now, oh my gosh. It's not rocket, hold on, let me get you a tissue. It's now a couple liters from, it's now a couple liters, God, I can't even talk. It's now a couple hours later from the last time that I vlogged, and we took a nap. We ended up taking a nap. Uh, we came home and just hung out for a little bit, and then we put her down for a nap because she was super tired. And then me and Patrick watched a movie and I fell asleep in the middle of the movie. So me and Grayson were just like knocked out for like two solid hours. But this little girl did have like a little bit of a, a little bit of like a stuffy nose this morning. And I was hoping it wasn't going to get worse, but she is like so runny nose right now. She has a little bit of a cough and I can just tell that it's getting worse. Not really the good time for this because we go on vacation in nine days. If I'm doing the math correct, we leave on the 20th and today's the 12th. No, no, that's eight days. So we go in eight days. So pretty much a week. And I mean, that gives kind of enough time to be sick and let it go. But sometimes it like takes a couple days. Like if I'm going to get sick, I'm trying not to get sick. I'm really trying. I keep washing my hands and sanitizing them. And I'm literally going to go around and start cleaning like all of the stuff because I know I'm not dealing with this and I'm not going to let it get in the way of our vacation and like ruin it because that would seriously be horrible. I just want to like rush to the store and get a bunch of like fruits and vegetables and just like fill her up with those and I need her to drink a lot of water and we just need to keep sanitizing and washing our hands and I don't know, I wanna get fresh air. I feel really stuffed up in this apartment and I'm starting to feel a little bit sick, which is like, no, 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 no. I can't be sick, I cannot do it. This little missy just wants to lay in mama's bed. Look at her. She has her poor little sick eyes. She's just watching Bubble Guppies right now on her tablet. That's literally the only thing she uses this tablet for, is to watch Bubble Guppies. So, I'm sorry, Mama. I'm sorry you got sick. I'm sorry. My poor baby. I'm keeping a track of her. Like, okay, I, I usually don't go out in public after I just took like a hardcore nap, but I actually think my makeup and my hair looks 
pretty good for taking a hardcore nap. Like I remember I had my face buried, buried in my pillow while I was napping because I woke up for a split second and I remember my face being in my white pillows and I was just thinking like, oh cringe, you're wearing so much makeup right now, Olivia. You're gonna ruin your pillows. I, I swear you guys, she has gotten so like sick. Not so sick, she's just gotten a lot of like colds and coughs this winter and this is the first time that she's ever gotten sick like this year, actually like sick. And I swear on life, I don't care what anyone's conspiracies are, but it's because I do not breastfeed her anymore. Like 100% because Grace almost breastfed until basically until she was two and around the time where like the colds start coming in a lot like I wasn't breastfeeding her anymore like coming into this fall and um winter and I swear that's why she gets so sick like breast milk just it has so many like disease fighting substances in it like more than normal in it so it helps block off so many like diseases or sicknesses so it helps fight off a lot of like common like illnesses like colds and stuff like that so i don't know if you guys do know this but when you, if your baby like is sick while you're breastfeeding it your milk can like or your body can like detect it so it starts to pass antibodies through your body which eventually go through your milk which eventually get to your baby which eventually leads to destroying bacteria in your baby's stomach before they can actually get sick that's why i swear like I swear ever since she has been breastfed, I swear that's why. Because she's a she's a very healthy girl. She was never sick her whole life. Um, she has been exposed to a little bit more things. Like I take her out to other places and stuff, but I always try my best to sanitize her. But you know, my conspiracy is, is that liquid gold was like the only medicine that I ever needed. I swear breast milk is like, the cure of all things. Breast milk, breast milk is literally liquid gold and it literally cures everything. <laughs> like, I'm a strong believer. It is like, breast milk is freaking magical, you guys. But anyways, I'm just gonna go ahead and um, go to Target right now, I think. I don't know, I kinda wanted to stop at a different store though and see if I could find some stuff for vacation. For some reason I have this itch to go to Burlington. So I might go to Burlington because I know Target stays open uh, late and it's six. I don't want to be gone too long, but I don't know. We'll um, I just, I went into Burlington really quick and they literally had nothing in there and I'm kind of salty because I drove like a little bit to get there and they had like nothing. They didn't have like any like spring or summer things out. So I'm just gonna go Target because I know trusty Target will have probably what I want. So I'm gonna go spend some time in Target. Okay, I am in the bathing suit section because I'm trying to find, oops, and I keep knocking things off the freaking racks. But I found, I bet you none of these will work. I bet you all hate the way all these look, but I found this one and then I found this one. And I'm gonna try a high-waisted bottom because I have a mom bod. Okay, after spending like hours in the dressing room, I ended up with three things, which was expected. But now I'm trying to find Miss Gigi Girl some shoes that she can kind of wear with a lot of outfits, like versatile shoes. I'm kind of liking these, but I don't know if these are comfy. Oh my gosh, these are so freaking cute. I love these type of shoes like on Graceland. Okay, I just scanned them on Cartwheel and they do have 10% off. So I did find her size. I think I'm gonna get her these ones. They seem pretty comfy and they're also like Velcro too. Patrick sent me this super cute picture of Gigi. She's just chilling, drinking her water and I think she's eating pretzels, but I thought this was super cute. All right, now I'm looking at some stuff for Miss Gigi girl. I found some shorts and stuff, but I really wanna get her this hat because it's so cute and it'll also protect her little half bald head, but I know she's probably not gonna wear it. So I'm gonna use my brain and I'm just gonna put it back cause I know she's not gonna wear it. They have so many cute bathing suits here. There's like so many cute choices to choose from. Look at this little bag. That's so cute. It's like a little toddler beach bag. I'm looking a little bit beat right now, but it's okay. Hi guys. It is the next day and I just wanted to finish off this vlog. Yes, I'm in my robe because I'm not feeling too well and I'm trying to be comfy. I just kind of stopped vlogging 
uh, yesterday. But I did have, I did end up going to the store, obviously, like you guys saw. And I did do a little bit of shopping for vacation because, like, the days are days are ticking by and I need to get that done. Um, and I also did get Graceland some Tylenol because I needed that because the one I had was expired. And then I got, like, some juice and some fruit and stuff like that just uh, to try and help her feel better. She ended up being fine she never really spiked a fever i mean it got a little bit high but it wasn't really considered like a fever and i was able to we were able to keep it down uh but she is still she is a little bit under the weather she's been very tired she's laying down right now in bed because she just she doesn't want to get out of bed she's not really active you know how it is when you're sick you just don't want to get up so i've been trying to push fluids on her and try and make her feel as good as I possibly can, but she's just relaxing right now. So I did just want to do like a quick little haul of what I got from Target. Most of this, actually no, all of this is for our vacation. So I'm going to just go ahead and show the things I got first. So I got this bathing suit, which I'm not even sure if I'm going to keep this. I might return it. I'm not sure, but I really needed a new bathing suit. So I ended up getting this one. It's super cute. It's like strapless, but then it has these little like sleeves that go on your like it's like off the shoulder and then it ties in the back like this it's actually a really really cute bathing suit for some reason i'm always attracted to black bathing suits and then i just got high-waisted bottoms i've never had high-waisted bottoms because i hated the way they look but um i actually think they looked pretty good with this bathing suit so i just got top and then the high-waisted bottoms i'm in love with this it is a cover-up so um, if you haven't watched my last video where I mentioned where we're going, we are going to Florida. So it's going to be warm and this is just super cute. It's just a little beach cover up. It's a sheer cover up, but I love the floral print on it. You guys saw in the vlog I showed, I did get Grace on these shoes. I actually think these are a little bit too big for her because I tried them on here and they're, they're a little bit too big. So it's weird because she's like a nine and a 10 in certain shoes but for some reason these ones don't fit her that well so i might have to return these and get an eight but i just got her these to have a pair of sandals that she can like basically wear with every outfit when we're there i got her two new bathing suits because she was gonna need them for summer anyways she only has one bathing suit right now um and it's just getting like worn out especially from going to swim lessons so i just got her this super cute one it is just a tank top like bathing suit it has a little coral flower on it and then it just comes with these coral bottoms this one i love this one because especially since like i said we're going to be in florida i don't want her like getting obviously i'm going to put sunscreen on my child but i don't want her really getting exposed to too much sun so i love these because they protect them a lot from the sun and they're also not they don't get like as cold in the water because it's not directly on their skin um, I don't know. I just I really like these for like smaller kids. I think these are really nice for them So it's just like a swim shirt and look at how cute the pattern is and then it just comes with these little bottoms And they're like little ruffle and the same design on the butt. So I thought that was adorable It's always good to have two bathing suits uh, because they get kind of gross after you're like swimming and out and about a lot in them they get gross so it's nice to have like two options i did just get her a pair of these black like drawstring shorts because she needed a pair of those and then these are so freaking cute they're like these little jean shorts and they have this lace on the bottom like look at how cute that is and then i got her uh this shirt to go with it she really didn't need like i mean she needs clothes for summer anyways, so why not? But look at how cute the sleeves just flare out and they have lace on them. It's just like that. So I thought this would go super cute together. I got her this because it has a camera on it and it looks exactly like a Canon G7X. And I just thought it was like, I thought it was perfect. <laughs> so it just says big smile on it. Super cute. I just got her two pairs of these um, like biking shorts just to go under dresses because she doesn't really have anything. She doesn't really have anything to go under her dresses and she needs something to go underneath them. So 
that is about it that is all i got from target let me know if you guys want to see like if you guys want me to film like me packing for florida i know i've gotten a few comments about it already but i don't think i do like a separate video about it but i might include it in a vlog so let me know if you guys want to see like how i pack and what i pack for a trip like with my almost three-year-old that is like crazy to say but yeah, I'm not going to go off on a tangent because I know this vlog is already very long. So thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already. Also hit the notification bell down there to get notified every single time we upload a video if you do not want to miss one. Yeah, I think that's about it. So thank you guys again so much and we will see you guys in our next video. Bye. Ooh.